know, that's right. We know the Medusa is going to. Huh? 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 What? Oh. Oh. Oh, man. I thought this was the nightmare. I was mistaken! This is Adventures of Lolo 3, and I'm Sakimoto Fanboy. I'm back here again to entertain you guys! Yes, that's my mission in life. I'm trying to entertain you. Let me entertain you. Why not? What have you got to lose from it? I know what I have to lose from it. <laughs> my sanity! But that's alright, because this is a fun game. It's a game that demands quick reflexes and uh, not much else, really. At this point, it's all about the reflexes. You don't really need a lot more. You also need to remember that Mobis suck in more ways than one. And we are going to need this guy again. Now, these stages here are starting to become ridiculous. I mean, sometimes I can't even begin to figure out what the hell I'm supposed to do. So I run around in circles, just experimenting with everything and anything, just trying to get something to work. Like this, for instance. Did you know that if I just try to run past here, I'll die because I, I'll force the Moby will force me to push the box up and kill me through the Medusa? Well, if I just do this and then try it, I'm fine. A lot of you are probably groaning right now, and so you should. But still, yeah. Power of Poof, and we go to the next level. And, wow. Okay. Now... I'm thinking I want to do this. Now this level is interesting, to say the least. <laughs> because there are a few things that you need to do in a certain order. Like most other stages. And you need to do these quickly. Okay? Put the box here and run back quickly. Now run up here and wait for the snakey to respawn. We will use this little trick again later on. And uh, in fact we'll be using the same snakey. At, at least I think we will. I don't remember too well. Yes, we will. Okay, okay. Now, we'll run down here, and while I'm putting you there, I'm just going to kill you quickly, and, hmm, I think I might have screwed it up now, but I'm trying to do this nonetheless. No, it's okay. It's okay. I can still salvage this. Ah! Okay, yeah, we needed that snakey to cross to the heart, but we can't really use that snakey from the other side, so we need to do this. Self-explanatory, isn't it? And now we need to stand here again and wait for the snakey to respawn. And I hope a lot of you are going, what the hell, right now, because I certainly did. You know, in fact, it was all thanks to Haruama that I actually even managed to s solve... <laughs> that I even managed to solve one of these, because she is a lot smarter than I am. Seriously, she's a lot smarter than I am, and she's also she manages to think in those extra weird kind of low low logic chains that chains that you need to use, like like take it a step further and go, why don't you do that? And maybe that'll happen if you do that, you know? That's that's the kind of logic that you need for this. Well, anyway, that's one more stage in the bag. I'm just gonna Haram method. Oh wow. <clears throat> okay, how did you do this again? Okay, um, let's do that, and let's do that, and let's do this, and, huh, okay, yeah, the, these are kind of far-fetched, I will give you this, um, I, I have solved these, and I did it after quite some time, uh, I won't say it was easy, though, hmm, I'm thinking this will be enough, but I'm not too sure. I'll just try to do this. Uh -huh. Okay, did I miss something? Was I supposed to... Yeah, I was, wasn't I? Yeah, I was. I was supposed to use that snakey to grab the heart. Or was I? No, because he will respawn later. Never mind. <laughs> okay, now we want to do this correctly. There we go, and run back. And we're going to run all the way up here. Here. Yeah, are we? Yes, we are. And sorry if I seem a bit confused at times here, because it's just... Some of these solutions are so weird that you can't even imagine how weird they are. But you will see how weird they are. Oh, okay, we need one more heart now, because we need the ladder power, so run around here. And, hmm, I see I've forgotten a snakey, but that's okay, I can do it now instead. Haha, <laughs> there we go. Okay, now we have ladder power. And 
Ha ha! Yeah, that was easy, wasn't it? Oh my lord. My head. Okay, room nine. Oh, wow. Let's see if I can remember this one. Okay, uh, let's see. Yeah, this level here, it's based on the replacement of stuff technique. It's cheap. It's very, very cheap. Watch this. Kill the snakey. And quickly, you want to make sure that the snake responds someplace else. So we're going to put the goal up here. But now, when we see that the snake is responding, we're going to kill the goal. We're going to run around, and we want to make sure that the goal also responds in a different place. So we put the snakey there, and now we're done. Did you follow the dick logic on that one? I didn't either, and that's quite okay, because this is Adventures of Lolo, and it pulls stuff like this out of its hat constantly. Now we can safely use the snakey. And traverse the waters. Dum dee dum dee dum dee dum. And run up here, and we will use the power of poof. And we're done. Wow. Okay. Now, this one is actually not. Well, it is. It's, it's hard, but it's hard, but it's not. It's pretty straightforward. It's just one thing that you have to do. One thing in particular that will stump you, I think. Now, see, we want to make sure that. Well, we can't take that hard, but we want to take this hard. And well, now we are gonna try and come on, Moby. Don't do don't do this to me. Aha. Uh -huh. Okay. Now up here and here. Now this is where I will probably screw up because you need to do a very stupid thing here. Okay. Stun him and ah. Uh -huh. No. See, that was yeah. You you're probably going. What the hell are you doing? But yes, that is the way you're supposed to do it. You just need to be very quick. And, you know what, I think this game has completely lost its puzzle roots. Right now, it's an action game. It has nothing to do with thinking anymore. It's just stupid trial and error, and... Ah! Okay, great. We did the first one. Unfortunately, there's another one <laughs> that we will need to do further up. But, I'm thinking I might be able to do it. I was lucky with this one, so... Well, you never know. No, but still... This game is no longer about solving puzzles. It's reflexes now. Okay. Ah! <laughs> yes! I did it! That's all you need to do, folks. Okay, and we have one shot left. So we're going to stun this guy. Just go down here and get the treasure chest. And poof! That felt good, didn't it? Well, this, however... Ah... <sighs> Can you fear can you feel the fear? It's room 10. Beyond this door here. I think this might lead to the final boss of this game. And you know what? I'm too terrified to encounter to do that encounter right now. I think I think I'm going to save it for next time because you know the ending, you know, the last one it was not too bad and this one might actually be even better, so I want to save this for for the next time, so that we have a decent amount of time to finish up everything and show you the credits and stuff. You know what? I'm just going to do it next time. Until then, I am Sakamoto Fanboy. I'll see you next time.